From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us on this Friday, June 20th, 2014. In the news, the state government denies that its laws on marriage curb the constitutional rights of five same-sex couples, couples that is, suing over Alaska's gay marriage ban. Alaska voters approved a constitutional amendment in 1998 defining marriage as between one man and one woman. State attorneys say Alaska isn't required to recognize same-sex marriages performed in other states and that as a sovereign state, Alaska has the right to define and regulate marriage. The 1st Striker Brigade Combat Team 25th Infantry Division changed commanders yesterday in an official ceremony at Fort Wainwright. Colonel Brian Reed transferred his command to Colonel Don Hill. Colonel Reed commanded the brigade for two years, leading soldiers that just came back from a year-long deployment in Afghanistan. Colonel Hill has been with the Army for over 20 years, serving in command positions from platoon to battalion within the Ranger Regiment, 10th Mountain Division. And tomorrow morning is the start of the Yukon 800. What's been called the world's toughest riverboat race will be in its 54th year this weekend. Pike's Landing will host the ceremonial start at 11 a.m. This year's purse could be anywhere from $22,000 to $30,000, which would be a record. Crews can still register. You have until this afternoon at 5 p.m. at Pike's to sign up. The first finishing boat could come into Pikes at about noon on Sunday. Looking at the Fairbanks weather, flood warning in effect for the Upper Chena River till 1.15 p.m. tomorrow. Today at showers and fog this morning, becoming partly sunny with isolated thunder, uh, thunderstorms, that is, in the afternoon, highs in the upper 60s. Tonight, mostly cloudy, scattered showers, lows in the upper 40s to lower 50s. Saturday, it's mostly cloudy with showers, isolated thunderstorms in the afternoon, and highs in the upper 60s. Extended forecast, unfortunately, it showers Saturday night, but then mostly cloudy through Thursday. Highs near 70 into Monday, low to mid-70s Tuesday through Thursday. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. The rest of the News Center team will be here tonight at 6 with the Fairbanks Evening News on KTVF Channel 11. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching and enjoy your day.